Okay, gang. Let's move it forward. Now I need to talk to one of my favorite people. Des Demona Des Demona I have a report here. It reads more like a comic book. Apparently, one hell of a fight took place at Green Tech Genetics. Oh. What have you heard? One of our agents took a courser. Alone. Something I'm not even sure Glory could do. And that agent is you. I'm all for one less courser in the world, but why'd you do it? That chip in his neck just looks so shiny. I couldn't help it. You have one of their chips intact? Follow me. Now. Decoding a courser chip is a very delicate operation. A million things can go wrong. The least of which is losing the data. Fortunately, we have the right man for the job. Hey, dude. You need something? Tom, we got a courser chip. Whoa! For real? Oh, man, it's been ages! You've hit the jackpot with this. Hand over the chip. Let's see what's on it. Go. All right, Tom, make it happen. All right, little Corsa Chip. Let's have the circuit analyzer take a crack at you. We're Did in. Chip accessed. Just poke the analog and How do you even this. fit down here in that? What? Oh, man, don't, don't, don't crash. Hold it together. Memory here, go. Here it comes. Encryption algorithms. All right. All right, we're still running. Oh, man. They've added more decimals to the last cipher. This is gonna be... Come on, baby. Show me that pattern. Where is it? Wait. They're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. Oh, man, we got lucky. I got you, you institute bastard. I got you. Software in. Come on. Show me that sweet bass number. Come on, man. Then we got it! We got the code! <laughs> Let me load that onto the hollow tape for ya! Good work, Tom. Hey, yeah, but I'm not sure our luck will hold up next time, Des. And, Agent, I hope that helps you as much as you've helped us. Good work. Okay. So now, we have to return to Virgil. Virgil? To the rocky cave. Wee. Ah, radiation. You unbelievable bastard. surprised. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a course. Ah, I should have gotten How sarcastic. You manage to get it decoded? The railroad helped me. Oh god, those kooks. <laughs> I would have expected they'd be too busy trying to liberate vending machines or setting computer terminals free or... Sorry. They just have something of a reputation. You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could. From memory and things I've overheard through the years. Came up with some schematics for you. Wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. Here's the simple explanation. You need to build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. 
You know the craziest part of the design? That classical music station. That's the carrier signal for the relay. All the data's on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. I want to be clear that this isn't my area of expertise. I was bioscience, not engineering or advanced systems or anything. Bioscience? Advanced systems? Divisions within the Institute. Specialized groups working on various projects. It'll make sense later, but if you can build this device and make use of that code, you should be able to override the signal from the Institute's relay. Can you? I mean, can you build it? You have people that can help. This is a lot for one person, even you. I got it covered. Good, good. Because you've got to make it in there. For both our sakes. And don't you forget our agreement. I've helped you as best I can. If you make it in there, you find that serum. It's my only hope for ever being... normal. So you find it. Now go on. Take these and get to work. You do whatever it takes. Call on whoever you know to help you. Now this is the trigger point, and this oh, is... That's an odor. This is... Protect and serve. ...a critical point. But this is where you choose the ending. Now we're gonna go back to the castle, and then get Deke out of these Galadrags and send him on his way. And believe it or not, we're gonna take up again with the one and only Preston Garvey, because this is heavy-duty Minuteman stuff. And hopefully he's not telling me to save settlements left and right. And believe it or not, I don't think I'm going to go in with a, uh, a suit of armor. Because I'm hoping to get armor when I get in there. Then yes, I do know some of the, the tricks of what happens when you get in there. So I'm not expecting... You should be expecting a massive firefight, but we'll, we'll get there. Okay, let's see if this works. Player dot place at, let's do the caps like you have there, place at me, zero, 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 F, seven, eight, B, eight. There it is! You can't trust everyone. Hey, wouldn't you like that in real life if you lost a note? I can't trust everyone. There's your recall code. Where, where is that fool in his armor? Deke? He's acting like he's been actually recalled. Learn history lest it repeat. It's astounding how much we still have to discover out here. Okay, it was just at the slug. Let's fast travel again. Right here is fine. Otherwise, we'll have to go get him at the slog and he's stuck. Oh, there he is. Look alive. What's the word? <clears throat> you know, I'm having second thoughts on the whole recall code. Wait. You read it. You can't trust everyone. Uh, <laughs> uh, did I have you going? <laughs> Don't take it personal. Look, I lie to everyone. Maybe I'm just another human that has people back home he wants to protect. Then again, maybe not. <laughs> Let's 
Well, you're good in my book. Whatever or whoever you are. I want... If you believe anything, believe this. I'm in your corner. Always have been. That code I gave you is a hard truth. You can't trust everyone. Even if someone sounds sincere, they could be a synth replacement working for the Institute. The bitch of the problem is recognizing the 90% of the time someone's on the up and up, and the 10% of the time you're being played. Now. Look alive. Tell me what you want. What I want. Okay. Anything for you, pal. Get out of the power armor. Out of your power armor. I guess. So now I'll get in it. Did you just... My, my, how armored you look. I'm just gonna park it. Boobity, 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 okay? I really should put some actual stands up here for these so they look nice and cool and they're all lined up, but not, not today. We're just gonna park this puppy, transfer, pull the car. Can we pull the car on that other one? I wouldn't mind an upgrade. And after this, Deke, I love you, man, but let's walk up the outside of that for you. Transfer? Yeah, no fusion core. Now we're gonna need to do some serious Minuteman business. Never fear, sir. I Where will is your safety to the best of my ability. Whatever it is we're out here looking for. That fine I'm young man. We'll find it soon. Uh, is it just late? Maybe yeah, I need to sleep. Identity confirmed. Take a nap. Get it into the daytime. Oh, you're just hanging out. That's that guy's in my bed. Let's give it four hours. So that's a trick, folks. If you ever if you ever lose Deacon's recall code, like I did, what probably means I have two of them. Perhaps it will lift your spirits. Now, where is Preston? There he is, farming. I'll get these Seems kids to be growing well. Shit. Don't worry. Preston. What do you need, General? Let's do it. This is it. This is where we pick the Minuteman ending. Let's see. I have plans here to build a signal interceptor that can get me inside the Institute. The Institute? Why in the world would you want to mess around with them? They kidnapped my son. Damn. That's some bad business. Even for them. We'll give you whatever help we can. Don't worry about that. Now, assuming you could build this thing, what exactly does it do? The Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. This machine can hijack their signal and send me instead. Teleportation? For real? Wow. That would explain a lot about how the Institute manages to operate. If anyone can make heads or tails of those plans, it'd be Sturgis. I haven't found anything yet that he couldn't build or fix. Talk to Sturgis. Okay. Hey there. Is there something you need? Come with me. I need your help. You got it. Oh boy, it's an honest thing. Nothing Goodness, minute, man. And here's me without my autograph. Identity confirmed. Deacon, this you ever want to fight for a cause serve. bigger than a handful of people? You get back to me. Wait a minute. Hey. Is there something you need? Come with me. I need your help. I'm with you, General. It's not releasing Deke. Send Deacon to cancel. Go home. That was weird. Let's talk to Sturges and see what the next step is, and then we'll probably wrap this one up.
Help defend Longfellow's cabin? Are you serious? Fine. Yep, we'll do that. Great. That's gonna be the last thing we'll do. We'll talk to Sturgis. Well, I haven't been to Longfellow's. That that was a, a, a settlement I didn't really even finish. This could be tricky. But I got Preston Garvey, so what else? What could go wrong, really? Longfellow doesn't even like his cabin. Big things going on. I'm this close to getting into the Institute, and boom! Longfellow's cabin is attacked. Okay, we gotta get to the cabin. It's not far. Yes. Teleportation. I've been doing teleportation this whole time. Just fast, call it fast travel. You know, that's just what we do. Staring at a robo-brain, waiting to watch a whole bunch of guns open up on everything. I think I did arm it. I don't remember what state I left it in. I can't even picture Longfellow's cabin. Yeah, I, think I, I think I was already building concrete by then. But it should be a pretty happy settlement. But what's attack? What would attack it up there? We want to get inside the gun. That was it? Are you kidding me? Like, one thing, was it a bug? <sighs> well, on this note, ladies and gentlemen, I think we need to take a break here. Gather ourselves a little bit. And then we, when we meet again, we'll meet up with Sturgis. On this note, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.